Hi, welcome to Kindred Spirit Readings. This is for Sun, Moon and Rising. Um, I do apologise. I I, um, I was out yesterday and I had a little bit too much fun at a fun park. So now I sound like this and I just wanted to uh, let you guys know that I will try to be as clear as possible throughout the reading. I hope it, it is delivered um, that way. Uh, Leo, for you this week, I see a back and forth energy. You're going to be... Uh, challenged the, the, one of the biggest challenges for you this week is you're at your best you're seeing you know green light all the way and then all of a sudden you could just come to a complete stop um, I see you chasing somebody with open arms okay along with this I see that you were not happy with the way things ended I see that you don't believe it's ended officially but there is no way that you are seeing the light at the end of the tunnel so this could be falling apart as we speak Although you are adamant to try and get this individual or get to them, no matter what it takes, somebody with brown hair is involved, somebody that you have loved for a very, very long time. This has been extremely hard for you because you've not been able to communicate with them and there are no last words. You know, you would be happy enough to pick up where you left off. You don't believe that it, it is officially over in the here and now. But it has just been really difficult to obtain information about this person, which is probably one of the most hardest things for you to deal with. Because when you don't know about this person or their whereabouts or what they've been through or what they're going through, it's very, it's very difficult indeed. And it has been and it still is. And this is challenging in so many ways, more than one. So um, regarding your relationships, there's, there's something... A lot of other people that are getting involved in trying to locate this person as well. Um, I don't want to say they're missing, but uh, you know, not hearing from them, it's it's tough. I see travel in your cup. There's definitely going to be a short trip planned for you in the near future, very near future. I'm seeing towards the end of the week you'll have everything set up for you in terms of where you're going and what you're doing. And especially with your money, uh, I'm seeing that it's prepaid. So if the payment side of this short trip is going to be taken care of, that's first and foremost. So I'm seeing that, that it's definitely paid for and then the rest is, is easy. A lover who speaks volumes could care less about what you're doing or where you're going. This is nasty energy. This person is very passionate about the two of you moving forward having a future together although i don't see you sitting on the same page as this person it could be very difficult to connect with them they make it sound or they make it look really nice make it feel really good uh, but there's definitely something a little off on their end of the spectrum and yours about them but you are really trying you could be seeing yourself changing or you have changed in many ways <clears throat> definitely more ways than one perhaps uh, you're already you're already uh, prepared to move move along or move move forward but there's still a few things that I'm, I'm getting that are uncertain about this individual um, they still see that there's something wrong although they're not they're not voicing their opinion there still seems to be, and what I'm seeing is there's still a spark there between the two of you. But they just don't see that at all. But you may not know about this. It's very different for you because you've gone through this huge transformation. And it's almost as though you're not ready to fully commit. And you can translate this however it suits you. But the meaning behind this is you've learned not to rush into anything too soon, which is a good thing. But they make this so damn difficult. Thank you, Leo.